Mila Morphle, I've made you some lemonade. Lemonade! Whoa, whoa! Oops! Oh, um, I'll clean it up later. I really want to finish reading my book. Your tower. Oh, you ruined my drawing, Morphle. No, M Morphle, not. No, no. How about you two go and do something else? <laughs> yeah. Sure. <laughs> Evil! Mr. Action is here to stop you! M M Morpho be Mr. Action? Um, sure. I have built a machine that will make everyone fall asleep. <laughs> oh no! Mr. Action, stop you! <laughs> <laughs> So exciting! Ooh. Hmm, let's get this out of the way. Okay. <sighs> now, where was I? You haven't won, Mr. Action, with the help of. Where has the chest gone? Mr. Action! Hmm. Why did he take away the chest? Muffin, no, take a chest! Ah! You mean I build it again! I did not break your silly building! Uh, building no silly! Mila silly! You know what? I'm going to play without you! No! More for play without Mila! <laughs> more for play, no Mila! Whee! Wish. <sighs> no, Mila, no fun. Oh. Huh. I don't know what to draw. Oh, Morpha would think of something. That was a great book. I've gotten so mad at you for breaking the crayon on my drawing. Huh? Oh, that was a morphle. I did that by accident. What? Oh, did you also break Morphle's block tower? Um, yeah. And take the toys away? Mmm, yup. And break a stick building? Uh, probably. Mila and Morpho friends again? Of course! I'm sorry I did all those things, you two. And I'm sorry I caused you to fight. Can I stay your friend as well? <laughs> of course, Daddy! Yeah! Aww. Mm. All right, children. Today, You'll go to the workplace of an adult who will teach you all about their job. We can just spend the day with Daddy in the magic pet shop. This will be easy. No, no, no. It can't be your own parent. Can we spend the day with you then, Officer Freeze? I would love to teach you about the importance of the police in my city. Let's go, Mila and Morphle. All right. <laughs> uh, let's try and catch Morphle again. Yeah, let's go, Stein. Um... I don't see them anywhere, Stein. Hmm. 
maybe the school is closed today? What do we do now? Let's look around the city for them. What do we do now, Officer Freeze? Go on patrol? Write out some tickets? Well, normally I would chase the bandits by now, but I haven't seen them today. <laughs> I can finally relax. Here, have a donut. I feel like I haven't had lunch in years. <laughs> They're not here either, Stein. Look harder. They must be somewhere. What? The bandits are making a mess at the school? And at the park? Not in my city. Let's go, me land morphle. It's Officer Freeze! Hide! Uh-oh! I don't see the bandits anywhere. They must have gone somewhere else. <laughs> but look at that mess. They will not get away with this. Phew. That was a close one. Where should we go now, Stein? Uh, I don't know. Anywhere far away from Officer Freeze. <laughs> I'm sure we'll find Morphle sooner or later. Aha! Uh -huh. There they are. Stay in the car, you two. We finally get to see Officer Freeze in action. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Stop right there, bandits. You're under arrest. Arrested? For what? We haven't even done anything yet. Yeah, we have just been looking for Morphle all this time. You're being arrested for making a mess of my city. A mess. Why are you in the police car? Have you been arrested too? <laughs> <laughs> with my latest invention, I can reverse the gravity for any object I zap with it. <laughs> zap me, Professor Rashid. <laughs> With this mirror, I'll be able to zap myself. Whoa! Tumbling test tubes. I forgot to zap the zapper. <laughs> this is our chance. Oh, no! From now on, we shall be... The Gravity Bandits! <laughs> Morphle, go after them! We have to save that lady, Morphle! Hey, not in my city! Oh no! Morphle, morph into an airplane! Thank you. 
Look, they are at the magic pet store. With this zapper, we can steal all the magic pets we want. I am looking mighty fine today. Don't you think, Mr. Mirror? You certainly do. Hand us all the magic pets! No! Huh? No! We'll take this! to a race car. Stop it right there, Morphle. What? This isn't Orful. This is Morphle. Yeah! Oh, sorry, Morphle. Uh, I can never keep the two of you apart. Uh, which one is which again? Morphle is red, Orful is green. I knew that. <clears throat> well, the green one is causing all sorts of trouble in my city. Oh, no. We'll find Orful, Officer Freeze. Ha, great. And when you do, get him away from my city, will ya? Dad! Well, this is strange. What? Oh, no! It's awful! <laughs> ah! Look, Morphle! It's awful! Oh, no! Let's go after it! Don't leave me here. We need to get him down again. Morph into a fire truck. Thank you, Morphle. But Orful's gone again. We need to find him. All right. Everything's ready to start building. What? No, stop. Please don't do that. <laughs> there he is. Oh no, it's about to fall. Morph into a robot, Morphle. <laughs> Thank you, Meland Morphle. <laughs> but Orful's gone again. Still haven't found Orful. <laughs> Where else could I look? A helicopter. <laughs> I can look for Orful from the air. Oh no. Orful is the helicopter. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> help! Somebody help me! Morphle can help you. Morphle! Great! Look, Morphle. It's Orful. And he's getting tired. I have an idea how to get Orful away from the city. Shut up! 
<laughs> to celebrate the National Day of Dinosaurs, Professor Rashid has helped the city to organize a special dinosaur race! Wow, that's so cool! Let's join Tim Morphle. Morph into a T-Rex. But wait, we have another contestant. The winner of the race gets this beautiful award. Is everybody ready? Three, two, one, go! <laughs> Let's compete too, Yorn. Yeah. Dinosaurs, huh? Not in my city. <laughs> Congratulations to the winners! We didn't win, Morphle, but at least we have a fair winner. <laughs> Perfect. Morphle, morph into a hot air balloon. Yay! Ah! Welcome to my birthday party. Birthday present. Thank you, Daddy. 
Look, Morphle. Daddy gave me a balloon for my birthday. <laughs> oh! Oh, no! The wind swept away my birthday present. Let's go after it, Morphle. Morphle, go! Take your binoculars, Mila. Thanks, Daddy. Bye! Bye! Hmm... Ah! Oh? I lost my hat somewhere around here, but where? at my party. Um, Mr. Cloud? Can I have that balloon, please? It was my birthday present. Your birthday present? I thought somebody must have sent it to me for my birthday. It's your birthday, too? My invention is done. 
Come and see. I've invented a youth serum, which I will demonstrate on my assistant. Tubes, Morphle. I don't know how to take care of a baby. Oh, oh dear. Morphle, you have to take her to her daddy while I make an antidote. Oh, good grief. Morphle? Water is almost like a shower, and bandits like to be dirty. Sorry. You know, we could make the whole city dirty. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. But how do we do that? I'm sure there's a magic pen for that. <laughs> <laughs> With the power of this slimy magic pet called uh, Slimy, we will cover the whole city with slime! Yeah. <laughs> slime, slime, slime! We need to stop them, Morpho! Morph into. Not in my city, kids! What do you think you're doing? We need to 
to catch the bandits. What you need to do is clean up all this mess you made. Mm, but... No buts, Missy. I'll be back in a bit to see if you've cleaned all this slime. Let's clean this up as quick as we can. Murphy have an idea! That's great, Morpho. <laughs> now let's go after the bandits. Oh no, look at all that slime. Uh-oh. Look, bandits. <gasps> They're about to slime Officer Freeze's car. Morpho, spray their slime away with your water. What? You two again. You can start cleaning the fire station right away. Okay, Officer Freeze. <laughs> wow! Look, Morpho. Every place the slime has been is much cleaner than before. It's like some kind of magical soap. Ah. Let's go clean up the rest of the slime. Didn't we just slime this place? Yeah. We cleaned it all up. And now we're going to clean you, too. Oh, no you don't. Yawn. I know, Stein. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. You've beaten me, Mr. Action. Mr. Action, win again. Mr. Action, superhero. Uh, I wish I was a real superhero. <laughs> okay. Mila, superhero. <laughs> I don't have any superpowers, silly Morpho. Morpho, do? Wow, Mila, superhero! Wow, thank you, Morpho. Oh, oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Mila the superhero. Stop it, please. <laughs> Mila the superhero will stop your truck. Don't 
you worry. <gasps> Thank you, Miller. My ice cream truck. Thank you so much, Mila the superhero. Don't mention it, sir. That's what superheroes do. Mila, look! One more time, Yon. Okay, Stein. Drive <laughs> <laughs> away, Yon. But we're stuck. Thank you, Mila, the superhero. Yeah. Superheroes help people, but do you know what they do as well? No. What do they do? They put bandits in jail. <laughs> How about a little story before bed? Once upon a time, in a kingdom far away, lived a brave king and his beautiful daughter. But then a giant climbed the tower to her bedroom window and kidnapped the princess. Boring. What? Why doesn't the giant kidnap the king for once? But who's going to save the king then? The princess, of course. Well, fine. The giant kidnapped the king and ran off with him. Help! Oh, princess, save me! <sighs> oh, no! We need to stop that giant! Morphle, morph into a suit of armor! Perfect! Now you can save the king. No, we need a sword first! Magic sword! Yeah! Sword. But the giant is getting away. Hmm, I know. There's a magic sword stuck in a rock over there. Here, let me try. <gasps> Amazing. Wow. Did you see that? Okay. So what's so magical about it? It can defeat any monster by making a rainbow, so they will be happy. What? Ooh! Oh! We're sorry, everyone. We were stealing your stuff while you were busy. Until we saw this pretty rainbow. We don't want to be bad anymore. Oh, all right. But how will you find the king now? The giant is long gone. Hmm. You could ask the dragon. Yeah, the dragon should know. No, you have to find the giant. This story is about a giant. Take my horse to visit the dragon. Well, thank you very much. Ah, <sighs> fine. Do you even know where the dragon lives? Well, over there, of course. Our 
Are you sure you want to go in? It sounds s -s scary. The princess couldn't see anything. It was way too dark in the dragon's cave. Hello? So she decided to go out and find the giant. But first, the princess's magic sword lit up the cave. Okay, okay, nice trick. So you probably want to know where the giant lives? You should go to the mountain next door. Really? The mountain where the witch lives? So we visit her first? Okay. Go to witch! Oh no. Here's the witch. Go ask her. Well, hello there. Hello, Mrs. Witch. We are looking for the giant. Can you help us find him? Yes, I definitely know where he lives. Take a few steps back, my dear. A little more, please. <laughs> Yes, the giant's castle. And there's the giant. He is so big and scary. You need to save me, princess. But you'll have to defeat me first. And then the princess made the prettiest rainbow anybody had ever seen and turned the giant from bad to good. What? And they had a tea party to celebrate. Yay, I'm saved. <sighs> I guess with that, the story is done. <sighs> that was the best story ever, Daddy. You really think so? Can you tell us another story? Well, I can tell you another one tomorrow, but now it's time to sleep. In your sleep, you will be able to dream up any story you like. Come, Morpho. Let's go on a great adventure. <sighs> Thanks for bringing us, Mila and Morphle. Now, I can give the mountain giant a tour of the city. No problem, Daddy. Have fun on the tour. Let's go, Morphle. Morph into a race car. Here, put this on. This way, no one will be able to guess that you're a mountain giant. Giant. Easy, it's all right. Don't be scared. Ooh. Stop. Come back. Huh? Oh, not in my city. What happened here? It was a big guy who did this. A big guy with glasses and a mustache. Hmm. That sounds like Mila's dad. I'm on it. Wait. Why am I being arrested? You ruined my city. I don't know how you did it, but you did it. 
What happened? Mila and Morph, please go look for the mountain giant. I think he's very scared. And please get me out of here. All right, we're on it. I'm sure if we follow the path of destruction, we will find the mountain giant. Morph into a race car, Morphle. The trail ends here, so we must be around here somewhere. There you are, Mr. Mountain Giant. Are you all right? Good, but we need you to help us out. Daddy is in jail for the mess you made in the city. Do you want to help us clean up the city? That's great! Let's go! Ha-ha! <laughs> Monster! No, Officer Freeze. This is Daddy's friend, the Mountain Giant. He's the one who made a mess of the city. He's very sorry, but he has put everything back the way it was. Well, uh, all right then. And I can't put you in jail anyway. Ooh. You're way too big. Really? All right. And you're free to go as well. Thanks, officer. Thank you very much for coming back and clearing my name, Mr. Mountain Giant. That was very brave of you. Whew! It sure is hot today. Yeah! Purple and the ice cream. That's a great idea, Morphle. How about you get us some ice cream from the ice cream truck over there? Don't forget to buy me one. Okay, Daddy. The ice cream man is leaving. Oh, no! Let's go after it. Morphle, morph into an ice cream race car. Where is he going? Kids, would you like some ice cream? Yes, please. Great! I have a chocolate ice cream, vanilla, a strawberry, a jalapeno, a concrete, a raw onion, a mayonnaise. A um, I'll have vanilla, chocolate, and the raw onion for Daddy. I'm sure he'll like that. Yeah! Really? This is the first time I ever sold that flavor. <laughs> Thank you so much. Mm. Now let's get back to Daddy before his ice cream melts. <laughs> <laughs> After them, Morphle. <laughs> we 
We've lost him, Yorn. Oh. <laughs> oh, no, you didn't. Huh? Could really use some ice cream now. We're back, Daddy. Great. Uh, ice cream melting. Oh no. I really wanted that ice cream. Oh, oh no. We'll get another one real quick, Daddy. Hello, back again. Another raw onion ice cream, please. Wow! This is the second raw onion ice cream I've sold! Back to Daddy Morphle! Quickly! Yeah! This is the best day of my life. Ah! Oh, damn it! This is our ice cream now! Yeah! It is ours! Is that my ice cream? Uh, sorry, sir. <laughs> we didn't mean to... Give it back. Ah! Thank you, Mila and Morphle. The ice cream did not melt at all. Ugh! Raw onion flavor? Oops. Hi, Mila and <gasps> Morphle. You're so dirty. What did you do? <laughs> well, first we saw a lady who asked us to help her find the hat she had lost. I lost my hat. Can you help me find it? Morphle morphed into a search dog and looked everywhere for the hat. was really happy when Morphle found it. And then we saw Mechanic Joe. Morphle, I need your help. My tow truck broke down. And into a Triceratops. And a robot. Morphle? Couldn't you have towed the car? Oh, uh, yeah. But, but Builder Lawrence! Then Builder Lawrence asked us to help him. I left my drill on top of the building. Morphle Queen! site was really muddy. Thank you, Morphle. You did great, Morphle. But now, you really need to take a bath. Bath? Morphle, no like bath. Morphle, come back. Morphle, it's just a bath. Morphle, no like bath. Huh. <laughs> gotcha. Oh. Where is he now? <laughs> there you are. Uh-oh. <laughs> Come on, Morphle. It's just a bath. No. 
got you. No! Not for no one to pass! No! Not for no one to pass! I'll help, Daddy. Well, 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 at least Morphle is in the bath as well. Hmm. Morphle like bath! What? Now you like it. <laughs> oh, no. What's wrong? My bus broke down. How am I going to bring everyone to their work today? But, but, I have to be at the police station. They can't do without me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no! I have to go to the zoo. Who is going to feed the animals? And I have to go to my ice cream truck. Without me, there is no ice cream. <laughs> oh. Morpho, morph into a bus so we can help them. Yeah, let's bring them to their work. Oh, no! Morphle, jump so we can dodge the lady on the street! Thank you, Meal and Morphle! Thank you, and goodbye. You're welcome, Police Officer Freeze. Now, we only have to bring the ice cream man back to his ice cream truck. Whoa, what's happening? <laughs> oh, no! Now I can never get to my ice cream truck. Hmm. Morpho, try to get out of the bee. Morpho, morph rockets onto the bus. Bellissimo! You saved us, Morpho! Yay! We did it, Morpho! Everyone got to their work on time. We're late for school. Let's read a fairy tale, Morphle. Yeah! Fairy tale! Okay. Once upon a time, Mila and Morphle were walking through a forest, and inside that forest, they saw a house made of candy. Wow! They were really hungry and wanted to eat the house. I'll look for a cure to make me small again. Yeah! Roar! Ah, a dragon! Hi, Mila and Morphle. What are you doing? I got turned into a giant, and now we're looking for a cure to make me small again. That's awesome. Troy the dragon will help you. <laughs> the dragon helps them? This is a very silly fairy tale. You know, I hear they can cure anything in that castle over there. 
Great! Let's go there. Oh, no, you don't. I'm a pirate. Yar! And there's a bounty on giants. Oh, no! I'll protect you, giant Mila. Way too easy. What your fairy tale needs is an evil wizard. <laughs> Only by defeating me can Mila become small again. Oh no, it's the evil wizard. You can never defeat me. We'll see about that. <laughs> Send it right back to you. Ouch! That hurts! I'll stop him. And you can't fly if your balloon is leaking. Ooh, whoa! Ah! Awful robot! Grab! Wizard! I'll create a portal so you won't even get close. Ah! Evil wizard. Um, would anyone like a cookie? Cookies. Mm. Uh, why? Thank you. Oh, I have an idea. The evil wizard can't say what he does to stop us with his mouth full. But what? Mila the giant grabs the evil wizard so he can escape. I'll shoot him with my cannon. Yeah, and I'll use my fire. Muffo, energy beam. I'm not a giant anymore. Woohoo! Shall we do next? Oh, no. Catch the ball, Morphle. Oh, wow. That was fast. Now, throw it back. Don't you want to play catch, Morphle? Uh, Morphle, no want to play catch. Okay, do you want to draw something? Uh, Morphle, no want to draw. So what do you want to do? <gasps> do you want to play hide and seek? Uh, maybe. Okay, start counting. Yeah. Morphle, do you maybe want to hear a story? As the boy walked up to the house, the door opened on its own, and he heard a scary voice. Morphle, no like story. Well, you're hard to please today, Morphle. Shall we take a trip to the beach? That always cheers you up.
Let's build a sandcastle, Moifle. Huh? Where are you going, Moifle? Let's go somewhere else. Look at how much fun they're having, Morphle. Hey, Morphle, that's not nice of you. Huh? A popcorn! A delicious a popcorn! My, my! You're a hungry little fellow, aren't you? Whoa! Morphle, did you have breakfast this morning? No! Morphle, no one wanted the breakfast! Morphle wanted to play! So, that's why you've been cranky all this time. You didn't eat anything. Oh. Well, Morphle, dig in. <laughs> Did that help, Morphle? Oui. Are you feeling better now that you've eaten? <laughs> 